All right, let's talk a little bit about heel pain and uh, maybe a different way to look at it when treating things for plantar fasciitis um, or an actual plantar ligament injury have not worked. So you can see here this purple highlighted nerve. That is your tibial nerve. So I'm going to zoom way out, show you where it goes. So it comes from middle of the back of the leg and down. Let me actually just show you this way. So it comes off of the low back, okay, so the lower lumbar nerves, and then they start into the sciatic nerve, and then when it's about halfway or maybe two-thirds away down the upper thigh, in the back it splits, and it turns into your tibial nerve, which is this purple portion. So you'll see it goes down into a little bit of the arch of the foot. So once we are down in there, I want to show you these medial and lateral branches of it. So this is the lateral one, and what it does is it innervates the muscles of the foot that flex your big toe, move your big toe in, um, ones that are part of your arch support. Let me show you real quick. So a lot of these small muscles in here, these guys, these are all innervated by that nerve. And then when we are looking at your medial one, it also does... Uh, ones that help control your big toe, flex your toes down, things like that. Now the sensation part, um, it does not actually do sensation like skin sensation necessarily, but what it does um, is these superficial branches that come off of it, you'll see, those can give more of a sensation. But this nerve, where it's coming down, you'll see that it, it innervates this quadratus plantae muscle is innervated by this lateral plantar nerve, and that is very commonly one that's irritated and can seem a little bit like plantar fasciitis also. So it's just one to take note of. What it does is it helps to flex your toes because it helps pull on this tendon. Um, so anything that's requiring you pushing off the toes can pull on this guy. Anything that is pulling right here on the heel can give that same type of production of pain as plantar fasciitis issues. This is the other branch that I wanted to show you. It's your medial calcaneal branch of your tibial nerve. It is all cutaneous, meaning it does skin sensitivity um, and more superficial sensations. And it does the inside of the heel and the foot um, and a little bit of the lateral side also on the outside. So I just wanted to give you a little overview of that.